And with all this team success, I had to check out a practice where the Timberwolves players told me their secret to success is their ability to keep things loose and just have fun. So I decided to have a little fun with them as I put the Northwood baseball team on the spot. <laughs> What's the uh, worst purchase you've ever made? Probably the shirt I'm wearing right now. <laughs> you can't even see the sleeves on it, so. I bought a juicer two years ago, and I believe I used it one time, and I never used it again. I bought some fake cruise tickets when I was a freshman in college once on accident. <laughs> Got the phone call, and I paid about $800 for some cruise tickets, and they weren't real, so. You win. That's the best <laughs> answer I've gotten all day. Wow. What is the greatest cartoon of all time? Scooby-Doo is just my favorite back in the day. Because you could always figure out who it was. Oh, it was easy. Rocket Power. Uh, it's just the best show going on. You know, wiggity wiggity. <laughs> Who has the worst tattoo on the team? Definitely my roommate Ryan McClone. What is it? He has a uh, he has a Harry Potter lightning bolt on his thigh, <laughs> and also his number. Rob Spencer. What is it? It's his area code on, <laughs> on his shoulder, <laughs> but it, it wasn't professionally done either. Richie O'Neill. What is it? Yeah, uh, he's got a monkey on his arm. And the one with the monkey tattoo. I'm gonna have to see that. Right there. Awesome. <laughs> so if Coach Bischel agreed to do something outrageous if he won the national championship, what would you want him to do? I would definitely want him to shave his facial hair and do like some crazy kind of mustache. Probably shave his head completely and just have maybe mutton chops right here for about the whole summer, I guess. Dance to his favorite song on the pitcher's mouth. Okay. He's a funny guy, and whenever he starts dancing in the games, it's pretty fun. And that's when you know he's having a good time. So I'd like to see what his favorite song is and what he has in store. He's a good dancer? I don't know if I'd say good, but he's got some moves. <laughs>